everybody, welcome to the Go Gorilla podcast, film cast, all types of cast. Yeah, we're casting. We're casting. I'm one of your hosts, Ashia Dumont. I'm the other host, Paul Robinson, and we're at NAB, NAB excuse me, New York. Uh, we're going to run around in here like idiots and interview a lot of people and talk about some film stuff, so come join us. I have no idea what's happening. Yeah, yeah, so all right, let's find a booth. I really like this follow focus, actually. Where were they down there? They were over there. We're here with Barry from the ICANN booth. So Barry, tell us about these lights. So we've got quite an array of lights with us today. Uh, starting right here, basically this is our CB8. <clears throat> and the CB8 is basically our canvas light. It's very flexible, it's very lightweight, and it's made really and truly for going out and doing those interviews or doing uh, any type of lighting that you might, general lighting that you might need. Um, it comes as a single light, and it also comes as a two-point and a three-point light kit. Okay. The single light itself usually runs for about 459. Okay. And wow. then the actual light kits run anywhere from 99, uh, $999 for the two-point kit. <laughs> I was like, oh, that's up awesome. Up to sixteen yeah. ninety-nine for the three-point light kit. Okay. And that includes stands and bags and everything with the oh, kits. Oh, nice. Yeah. Okay. yeah, very cool. So great light, 2800 uh, Kelvin all the way up to 6500 degrees Kelvin uh, with about a 94 CRI okay. and a 96 nice. TLCI. That's the important number for me right Oh, yeah. There. Good numbers to know. Yeah. We're jumping up to the, to more of our studio line now. Uh, this is the LBX-20. You see, these for me, personally, I love this soft light that these yes. give. Oh, love it. This is very, very popular for us. This yeah. light and the light we're going to talk about here in just a second are our two most popular lights we sell for my camp. Mm -hmm. um, again, it's it's a very studio-centric light, has DMX on it, um, does a lot of uh, bicolor. It's uh, 3,200 degrees Kelvin to 5,600 degrees Kelvin. Um, actually, we sell accessories for it for, like, egg... Uh, egg crate as well as a uh, barn doors so you kind of get a little of everything this light really and truly used more for like news and talk shows that's okay. when we get a lot out of that okay. uh, and then this light right here runs around $13.99 okay okay great moving up to the next one <clears throat> SB200 SB200 is um, what we like to call a Fresnel kind of parish light Okay. What it is, is um, it's made out of the same case as like Pelican case material. Yep. Okay. It's very lightweight. Uh, it can run off a of V-mount or gold mount battery. Um, it is 2,800 degrees Kelvin all the way up to 6,500 degrees Kelvin. And it's very easy and portable, but it also has DMX. And one of the cool things about it is the fact that, like I said, since it's kind of like a PAR, you have a 30 degree lens and then you also have a 60 degree lens. Oh, wow. Yeah. Striking. Yes. <laughs> so very much a... Uh, an easy but fun light to be able to kind of work with. And you with. took that off pretty easily. So what kind it of is. mount is on there? It basically, it's it's actually a proprietary mount, but uh -huh. it, it looks kind of like a Bowens mount is what it looks okay. like. Okay. Um, you can do soft boxes. You can do pretty much everything you want yeah. to with this guy. And how bright does that get? This is equivalent to about a 650-watt incandescent okay. light. Okay. This guy right here has a 96 CRI and 96 TLCI. It's a very, very nice light. Yeah, very nice. Good quality color. Yeah. What was the price point on this one here? Uh, the SP200 actually is $1099. Okay. So, again, affordable light. Yeah. Uh, typically can run anywhere from $1099 to $999, depending on where you're buying it from. Moving on, we've got <clears throat> what is our brand new light. Now, this is a light we showed. You heard it here for maybe first, yes. maybe not. <laughs> well, we showed it at NAB this year, but it okay. was truly a prototype. This is pretty much the finished product. This is our RGBW light. It's oh, going to compete go. with everybody yep. else's. Yep. Um, basically, this light right here does all the bells and whistles that you've seen on the market for RGBW right yep. now. You've got HSI, you've CCT, uh, you've got um, your filters, you've got your special effects. You've got it's got all those bells and whistles inside awesome. of it, and it runs for about two thousand dollars. Okay, so all it's right. very affordable yeah. for what it is. We're finally glad we're, we're kind of out there and we're going to get it going. Should be ready to go truly for customers in about a month. Okay. Okay. So. That's not bad. That's, that's really Lastly, <clears throat> over my shoulder here, the LBX-20 hey. is like our LBX-20, just lights? in a longer version. Mm -hmm. This light right here is really made for green screens and for white screens. It's a okay. wash type light. Yep. So we get a lot of, of that. Again, going back to... TV stations love it. We sell a ton of these to TV stations yeah. because it's really I almost feel, though, like 
you know, being a filmmaker, we all love the book light. I feel like something you could achieve uh, something similar to a book light by throwing a big piece of diffusion in this. For sure. You know? I mean, you really could. This has a half stop permanent diffusion inside yep. of it. But I still get a lot of people ask me for, hey, I'd like to diffuse that light even more. Yeah. Make a book light, make something else, throw a, a, a frame or an 8x8 eight eight in front of it, mm -hmm. just to kind of get it a little more softer when yeah. I'm doing that. And it depends on who's using it, too. I keep talking about television stations. I get a lot of cinematographers that like I was like saying that, that I, 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 love, I love, you know, the softer the better. Yeah, you know? for sure. Um, this light right here <clears throat> in this form factor is very, very popular. Uh, it looks a lot like another light that's on the market. I won't mention it, but oh, it, sure. it oh, does. Yeah. But um, studio centric light, bicolor, uh, 95 CRI, 96 TLCI for both of these type of lights. Really, really easy to use and and well within affordable to to have. And what, did, did you mention the price point? Uh, I, this guy right here, he usually runs around 14.99. Can't beat that. Not awesome. bad at all. Awesome. Um, well, thank you so much for your time. Sure. Really appreciate Anytime. you talk, talking talking yeah, to us. Great talking with you yeah. guys. Great nice to meet you both. Thank you. Yeah. Paul, what do you think of this camera? I think it's um, it's got a lens on it, which is nice. I like this uh, streaming handle. Yeah. And this uh, this hole with the four dots in it. So it turns out that this knob here, when you look in here, it's blurry, and then you turn the knob, and it's not blurry anymore. Magic. Oh, leave alone, he's working. All right, well, see you later. Bye. Well, that concludes our day at NAB. And AB New York. We got stuff. We got a t I actually got an Ari shirt. You did get an I'm Ari shirt. I'm very excited about that. I didn't get any kind of shirt or nothing like that. Yeah. Somebody had wine. I didn't get any of that either. <laughs> uh, but whatever. I got bags galore. Yep. And uh, I kind of learned some stuff. Yeah, and, what'd you learn? Uh, what's, what's, the, what's the one takeaway you took from this place? Uh, Ari's going to start putting 4K uh, raw in their camera. <laughs> Black Magic is going to put 4K in there. I mean, Black yeah. Magic that's is, fine. is going to do we'll raw we'll in their new there. camera. That's going to be $1,200 that they don't have enough to ship of, but they will soon. Uh, I learned that. Yeah. Uh, I learned about the Matrix. Oh, God, the Roland Matrix. And, yeah. uh, you know, that DMX is in a lot of technology. Yeah, X yeah, is going to give it to us. X is going to give it to us. And I can't wait for it. <laughs> all right. Well, thank you guys for tuning in and watching and all that stuff. And, uh, you know, check us out at gogorillafilm.com, which will just forward you to Send3 Productions uh, slash gogorilla. But uh, check out the podcast, uh, all applicable links in the description below. And uh, thank you guys so much for watching. And thanks to Rocky for filming stuff. Thanks He's on the other Rocky. side of that there camera. This, he, uh, there'll be a link to him in the in the description as well. Yes.